Today you're going to learn how to play a game called Go to the Dump. Now, I don't know if you've ever been to a dump, but if you have, you might have seen something like this. Of course, that's not what we mean when we say we're going to play Go to the Dump. What we really mean is that you're going to play with a partner or maybe more than one partner and you're going to be playing with cards. But sometimes in the game, somebody's going to ask you for a card that you don't have in your hand. And when that happens, you get to say, go to the dump. Let's watch two boys playing go to the dump for just a minute. And then we'll take a look at how to play the game from start to finish. The boys that we just watched were playing Go to the Dump with cards that went from 0 to 10. But today you're going to be playing Go to the Dump with cards that go from 0 to 5. And then later on when you get to goal 3, you'll be able to play this game again with cards that go from 0 to 10. Now let's look at how to play the game. To start with, Alex and Grant would each get five cards. They deal them out like you would for any other card game. And then they would go ahead and look in their hand and see if they had any pairs of cards that added up to five. And when I say a pair of cards, I mean any two cards in their hand that added up to five. Let's take a look. Here are Grant's cards and Alex's cards. Let's look at Alex's cards and see what we think. Did you notice that one and four made five? And also five and zero. So Alex lays down the one and four right next to each other face up so that his partner can see that he made a five and he also lays down his five and his zero right underneath the one and the four so his partner can see that five and zero make five. Now Alex's hand is completely ready to start playing the game. He only has one card left, but don't worry about that. If he winds up laying down all of the cards in his hand, he gets to draw five more new cards. So everybody gets to keep playing until the whole game runs out of cards. When Grant checks his hand, he notices that three plus two makes five, and so he lays them down face up in front of him, and then he's ready to start playing the game. Alex is going to start first in this game, and since he has a two left in his hand, he has to think about what number does he want to ask Grant for that will combine with his two to make a five. So he decides to say, Grant, do you have a three? And Grant looks at his hand and he says, yes, I sure do. And so he gives Alex the three card from his hand. Now Alex lays the three and the two from his hand down in front of him face up and he's out of cards. So before they go any further, Alex gets to draw five new cards, and then he'll be ready for Grant to take his turn. Everybody just gets one chance to ask for a card, and then as soon as that play is over, it's the other person's turn. Before Grant takes his turn, Alex needs to check his new five cards to see if any pairs that add up to five should be laid down. Take a look at his hand. Does he have any two card pairs that add up to five? He doesn't really, does he? Even though he has 
a five, actually he has two fives in his hand, he doesn't have any zeros to go with them. So he can't really have a pair of cards that add up to five. So he doesn't have any cards to lay down right now. So it's Grant's turn. And I wonder what Grant's going to ask for. What do you think? So that's pretty much how you play Go to the Dump. Grant and Alex will keep taking turns, asking for cards, laying down pairs, and if either of them run out of cards again, they'll get to draw five new cards until they run out of their dump pile. And when that's gone, they can keep playing for another turn or two, and then they'll just sort of be done with the game. If they want, if you want, you can count up the cards that you've been able to lay down in your pairs and kind of see how many you were able to get. You can also tell your partner, what's the new fact that you're getting really good at finding without needing to count? Are you getting better at three plus two or two plus three or one plus four or four plus one? What are you getting better at? So, have fun with this go to the dump game and learn a lot.